Hello. Good evening, everyone. I am Tywin. I am the lead coordinator for the Wiki Loves Folklore campaign. And today we are here to know uh, how we can organize various Wiki Loves campaigns in your local country, in your local Wikipedia. So this presentation is being uh, is like an inspiration for you and all the people watching us live that to start your own uh, wiki loves campaign so with this uh, we start how was the wiki loves campaign started why was it started so the wiki loves campaign the main focus of this was to improve uh, the content from various focus areas. So it, it was like an, uh, can say the bridge to bring new contributors together and have outreach and awareness activities in the community. Also, it led to build com connections and partnership regarding the themes that were with this Wiki Loves campaigns. And through this, there was a community development. And so it was all started. And it started with Wikilove's art in 20, 2009 in New York. And then it went on with Wikilove's monuments, Wikilove's earth, and various other Wikilove's projects. So what are the essential plannings that needs to be done while having a, your own wiki loves campaign so first and foremost planning is necessary in order to have your own wiki loves campaign there must be a focus area the focus area is what you want to focus in which is this a uh, thing which uh, you want to gain attention of the users and what is the gap that you need to fill. There must be some uh, can say in order to have your own Wikilove's campaign, please start some small pilot projects which can be beneficial and helpful for identifying if there is any uh, can say more uh, uh, can say the more preparation needed for going international or having it local. Keep your campaign in the objectives of the Wikimedia projects and various scope of the projects, such as if you are planning to have your own Wikilove's campaign on creative on Wikimedia Commons. So please be aware of Wikimedia Commons project scope and what all can be uploaded to Wikimedia Commons and what is not allowed on commons. Also, if there is any project that has uh, to be conducted on Wikipedia, so please be aware of the notability guidelines and various local, uh, can say, laws that are in force. Also, have yourself familiar with various patterns and case studies that has been uh, uh, can say going on into this uh, uh, wiki sphere. Also have your online engagement campaigns and photo events. So this is the short link that has been provided. You can go to these links for more information. How can we plan during this process? The pl in order to have a good planning, there needs to be good team. And the team must be diverse and not have any, uh, can say, uh, if there is, if this project you are planning to be international, then make sure that you have various uh, users from various parts of the world so that they can know the local culture as well as what is happening on that wiki. The funding and the prizes, the various grant schedules, you need to be aware. 
the various you need to have some specific timelines for your project so that there is a time frame wherein you can upload or write the articles or expand or you can uh, create uh, various in uh, other translations also reach out to various potential organizers glams institutes in order to have some authenticity and in order to encourage the uh, communication between the wikimedia projects and various glam institutions outreach activities so what can be outreach activities you need to promote your project on various uh, social media sites on various uh, channels pages instagram as well as make some provisions to run some small advertisements on the social media so that it will be beneficial promote the same in your community using the village pumps as well as various uh, notice boards and also it can be a personalized message or some sort of information on the user talk page but it's recommended that the you use some uh, the village pumps so that the user talk pages are not spam you must have your own jury to evaluate and to bring out the various uh, can say prizes uh, for these wikilove campaigns and during the campaign what all is necessary keep promoting about your campaign through central notice uh, through mailing list village pumps social media give some instructional uh, have some videos have some uh, categories wherein we can Uh, give to the users to upload their images give some categories uh, for make some templates for them and also you can create some talk pages uh, templates which users can add to the talk pages and that can be identified regarding your project so once the uh, can say the contest has started please make sure that you continuously if it's a comments contest please make sure that you continuously keep on checking those images and check for copyright violations as well as various other uh, uh, out of scope images as well as uh, the images that are not in your project scope so please keep filtering out maintain uh, uh, have a regular review of the articles that are submitted during the pro uh, project and if it's on wikipedia please keep on seeing how the jury is working and how the quality of articles are been made these are the possible outreach activities that one can take on if it's a wikimedia commons based project you can have photo walks various uh, can say uh, events you can have a uh, meetups you can have community cafes wherein you can discuss about the project with your uh, various uh, community members as well as the person who is interested you can have editathons in which uh, users can create articles on wikipedia regarding that uh, uh, can say the contest that you have also you can connect with organizers who are working uh, or who have the potential uh who are working in the same domain so that you can connect and work together in a possible collaborative way what needs to be done after the campaign is over please make sure that you are categorizing those images properly as per your uh, project conduct the jury process in which you filter out all the unnecessary images that are there and you only make sure that uh, quality standards are abide for having jury process announce the winners and distribute the prizes submit the necessary grant reports as well as reports and uh, to the uh, community write a case study blog post and also uh, there can be a after uh, event video wherein you can make and show about the impact of your project 
let's see some examples of some successful Wikilaus projects. Wikilaus Monuments, it started in 2010 in Netherlands. It's a Europe, it was a European contest in 2011. It became international in 2020, 2012. And in 2011, it had Guinness World Record of the largest photo competition. Let's see some images of Wikilaus monuments. So these are some images that are, have won the Wikilaus monuments project. We go next to Wikilaus butterfly. Wikilaus butterfly was, is an uh, Wikimedia Commons project, which was made together with Bang, Bang, Bengali Wikipedia. It's an outreach program on exploration and literature surveys. Various high quality images of butterflies were uploaded and these images were used for depicting uh, in articles and scientific articles on Wikipedia. The content of butterflies was very less and due to this project, there was a huge, can say, uh, represent a visual representation of butterflies on Wikipedia. It had six iterations from 2016 till 23. These are some of the images of Wikilaus butterfly. And they're so beautiful. We start on to Wikilaus folklore. Wikilaus folklore I have been a part of Wikilaus folklore from uh, its start and that's the reason I have been, there has been an inspiration for me to help other, uh, can say, wiki projects grow and uh, give information about uh, how to organize a Wikilaus campaigns. So I started in Wikilaus uh, folklore since uh, 2019 uh, when it was founded uh, in the co-founder Rupika. And uh, we together had this uh, uh, Wikilaus folklore in 2019 as Wikilaus Love, which was renamed to 20, uh, Wikilaus folklore in 2020. The theme of this project was to document your way, your local culture on Wikipedia. As we had observed that the uh, local culture had various articles, but there was no visual representation of uh, images uh, regarding this culture. If we talk about uh, my own culture, uh, I belong to the East Indian community. There were no major images regarding the uh, community. Due to such uh, events and uh, programs like Wikilaus Folklore, we have been able to get on visual representations of various festivals, of various uh, uh, can say uh, traditions on the Wikimedia Commons, which were freely used and uh, can say uh, depicted in articles, which had given users a proper view of uh, what this uh, article is about. In uh, since uh, throughout these five years, we have been able to get content from 168 countries and over 6,414 photographers and volunteers have been uh, a part of Wikilaus folklore and they have been able to uh, upload 79.844 images, media, audio and videos in the last five years. Let's have some uh, view on winning images of Wikilaus folklore. These are the images of Wikilaus folklore. These are various examples, other examples of uh, Wikilaus contest that has been going on. It includes Wikilaus Africa, Wikilaus Art, Wikilaus Heritage, Villages, Food, Earth, Pride, Birds, etc. With this, we encourage all the users to have some uh, new form of Wikilaus campaigns and 
uh, this uh, presentation or can say these guidelines can help you to bring out your own Wikilove's campaign in your local Wikipedia, it can have in your own local country. Moving on to a new project, it's called Wikilove's Cosplay. It's the first time wherein Wikilove's Cosplay is being uh, organized. It's, it's organized by Wiki Vibrants and with the aim of celebrating young people. As you might be aware, uh, as we go move out of this room, there is a cosplay session that is going on. So, Wikilove's cosplay is an impo uh, can say uh, uh, best opportunity uh, wherein we can click images of cosplay artists and upload them on Wikilo uh, on Wikimedia Commons. So, uh, it's a project. It's it's not just for uh, the young people, but anyone who can upload, uh, click and upload images uh, to Wikimedia Commons regarding this cosplay. And we have Francesc who has sent us a video of Wikilove's cosplay, which I'm about to play. Hello everyone, here's Francesc Ford and I want to gladly introduce you to our newest campaign, which is called Wikilove's Cosplay. And, well, I believe that the title, the name of the campaign is self-explaining. Uh, it's a Wikilove's contest, uh, clearly inspired. You can even see the, the screen that we're sharing right now, how even the buttons of Upload Now that we can see here at the, at the right side of the screen are heavily inspired by the, um, the uh, Wikilove's folklore campaign. Wikilove's cosplay basically aims to catch um, a very particular um, field of uh, a subculture, we can say, an urban culture called cosplay. And of course, uh, I mean, we should explain a little bit how this works. Uh, the campaign was born as part of the project called Wikivibrance, to which I've been part for a couple of years now. And Wikivibrance wants to celebrate the youth in the Wikimedia movement. We are uh, basically working to uh, end up with uh, barriers that impede the collaboration or the participation of young people in the Wikimedia movement. Uh, so, uh, given that our, our aim is precisely to work with young people, we thought that it could be a good idea to develop projects interesting to young people. Why cosplay? Well, I, I, we thought that it, it could be funny. I mean, cosplay is uh, an urban culture uh, that consists of people dressing up like fictional characters. Uh, it has many advantages for us. The first and more important for us is that, uh, well, we are talking about uh, something that uh, it's interesting for young people and also it's interesting for Wikipedia because, uh, you know, they are covering um, they are covering fictitious characters and that means that uh, those characters that usually have copyright and now we can illustrate them without uh, ha you know without violating any any intellectual property laws so it's interesting for wikipedia because it allows us to illustrate uh, here is a character from a video game uh, that we don't have the copyright or here we have uh, some characters of um, some kind of japanese tv series and without cosplay, we couldn't be able to illustrate uh, such articles in such a way. So that's interesting for us. And it's also appealing for young audiences. And we have, um, you know, we have very good, we have very great cosplayers in our community. Because the idea was born in the Wiki Loves, uh, the Wiki, uh, the Wiki conference in Belgrade. I had the chance of meeting Dodi. Who probably you will meet here today in if you are outside in Singapore. And Dodi, who became a great friend of mine after sharing three days in the, the Wiki conference, talked uh, talk to me about his experience as a cosplayer, also in, in the movement and sharing his own pictures in the, in the movement. And we thought that it was a good idea to start doing things. 
And basically, uh, Wikimania was a great uh, opportunity because if you're aware of uh, his sound session in Wikimania, uh, some folks are visiting a cosplay uh, a comics um, event that is happening real close to the site. And um, I mean, it's a great opportunity to celebrate precisely this, to celebrate the cosplay culture in the movement. We have a campaign, as said before, it's a campaign we can upload. Uh, there are some rules, especially when it comes to personality rights, uh, um, photograph or identify people, and of course the code of conduct, because uh, there is um, a phrase in the movement that says, in the cosplay movement, that says that cosplay is not consent. So we must be really, really aware of that. And also we have three, three awards, best overall Photography, best cosplay costume, and best photograph of series or character not represented yet in Wikimedia Commons. Each of the um, awards uh, we intend to give a uh, 300 uh, US dollars uh, prize for each of the winners, and we have asked for a rapid grant for that. And participation is really easy. We have here the button of upload node, so it works exactly as the folklore campaigns. We have here our own upload wizard with a personalized message upload your cosplay pictures and when you click on select files you can upload your pictures and it works exactly the same as it would uh, work on um, on any other photography campaign so this is a real quick uh, campaign that it will be it will last for approximately one month, so you have up to, up to mid-September to participate and share your pictures. So go ahead and please be part of this Wiki Loves Cosplay campaign. Hello. So, if you have any questions, feedback, and suggestions, the the forum is free. Open. Have I bored you all? No questions? Any questions online? Can I take pictures from outside and upload them to comments for your process? Yeah, you can. Then I'll be the first participant. Please make sure that you take consent. Okay, so with this, we end the uh, talk. Thank you very much for joining in. Have a good day.